Hey everybody, it's Julie Cat, Julie, Jules, Julia, whatever you want to call it. So I got salsa picante to patio, if I'm saying that right. And why is our queen on ridges? I'm probably gonna turn this into a cooking show too, because I have some chicken marinating. I'm gonna make it. All right, I just had one of these. It tasted good. This guy looks funny. Yeah. Like, he looks like an old school man. There was this one nice to restaurant that I loved going to when I was a kid. It was called like Chasis. I don't know, but I have like memories when I was like four years old going there with my family. It was in New Jersey. You're like, I'm from Brooklyn. Born and raised. But I've also lived in other girls. My fiance. Dr. Bessel's sister in the world. I love cats so much. My parents are awesome. That's funny that the TV said that when I talked to my parents. I feel like I have like this special short spiritual connection with my parents. I, I'll be mentioning them in the conversation and they'll text message me. You know what I'm saying? Good. It's like the sour cream the onion goes with the 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 um hot sauce like the pepper it goes with it. Wow. Well. I'm watching Saturday Night Live. I'm not sure if it's a new episode or a rerun. Oh yeah, it's a rerun, because I see what time it is. Um... Well, I'm also drinking coffee and drinking green tea. Arizona cold. Like my favorite thing is um, spirituality and music. Right. Sorry, not to do that. But um, I love singing. I've been in a choir when I was a kid, like a teenager, and I took piano lessons. And I'm just like, I mean, I got like two short basic lessons of drama so I just actually really good at it. And um
it's like a song right I sing as I go along, I freestyle rap, I do all sorts of genres like country rap, pop, rap, pop, like pop, you know, like rock and roll, jazz, R and B, you know, any I can do anything, like I can do any genre if I have the right mood to write it. But yeah, let me um rinse out this sponge. I mean that yeah, sponge and can. As I make it, I'll decide if I'm going to make it Parmesan. Okay, so I got to get my breadcrumbs. Progresso, Italian style. Get my eggs. Um, right here, the milk, and you, and you use um, breadcrumbs, milk, and eggs to make breadcrumbs for chicken. Hey Don, um, I'm making a cooking show. I'm making a cooking show. Don, come here. I'm making a cooking show. What is the baby cooking? Um, chicken, chicken parmesan from my Italian marinade. All right. Baby, you don't seem to be interested in coffee at all. Oh no, I'm interested. Alright, alright. Make your own, babe. I made you one. Yeah, so that's, that's my coffee. You little cutie. You little cutie. This is part of the TV show. Now, where'd the camera go? My baby's the cutest baby in the world.
Yeah, and that's my fiance named Don. Okay, I cracked the egg. I should have showed you that, but that's okay. I'm going to get better at this. I'm going to start making cooking shows. Okay, so the egg is cracked. Alright. Egg is cracked. Add some milk. And guess what I did at the beginning of the show? Had the breadcrumbs ready on the plate. You can use less than that. I used a little, not like too much, but more than I would need to. Probably because this is my first cooking show. <laughs> anyway, um, let me show you my chicken. I already rinsed it off. It's been marinated. I had a bigger piece um, earlier today. Yeah, so. Um, here, let me turn this light on. Okay. This is how it looks. I'm gonna put it in, in, the, in the egg. And milk. And milk. Mm -hmm. I told my baby how to bread, right, baby? Mm-hmm. You can could, you could bread veal and pork chops the same exact way, you know that? Yep. That's exactly the same way. I'm, I've made pork chops before, but I want to make veal parmesan. I don't want to make... I think it's a little sad, but they do with the calves. I know. I like I like eggplant parmesan the best out of all these. Yeah, eggplant's good. I don't know how to cook it up correctly. I love eggplant parmesan, so good. And that's the most animal safe. Because it ain't an There's some trivia for you. Okay, 
Okay, so I'm turning on the stove. Let me show you what I'm doing now. I just gotta wash my hands real fast. This lighting is better. Yeah, it looks good. Okay, I'll put some olive oil in the pan. It's already on medium heat. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm not sure if it's showing right, but I'm gonna add some olive oil, let it heat up. I'm gonna. Let's see, is it lined up right? Yeah, it's lined up right. I'm gonna add some seasonings to my um, chicken. I'm gonna put some salt, of course. Pepper, I'm gonna lower this heat to like low, like into medium low. Um, put some pepper. Onions and herbs. Alright, baby, you uh, want the milk here? I need the cap for the milk. Thank you. Thank you, baby. Is that, is that perfect? My baby is beautiful. Oh, thank you. I don't expect you to find the cap for the milk. I didn't expect you to when you pull it out. Let me get to the fridge so I can put the milk away. I'm sorry for interrupting you, Joe. It's okay. Maybe my, maybe my kitchen is a little too tiny. We're not gonna have these problems with the new house. No, it's 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 not. It's it's fine for now. You know what I'm saying? I'm having fun anyway. Okay. Did I put garlic on it yet? No, I don't think so. Okay, so maybe a little bit of adobo would taste good with that. Well, now if you're feeding it to me, I can't take adobo. Well. What do you want, half of it? Uh, yeah, I'll probably have an appetite later. Okay, so, so I won't, I won't adobo. put adobo on it. But you can put some of the complete seasoning on it. Yeah, I did already. Okay, did I describe all the seasonings? Yeah, I, that's the only one I didn't say. The one that I, the one that I put well, down without people, saying was complete seasoning. Tell the people at home what complete seasoning is made of. Why don't you say it? All right, well, where's the camera? Hold on, I'm, 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 I'm okay. Where's the camera? Oh, you're holding it. Put it on the yeah. toaster. Hi, everybody. Hold on, wait. I've got to switch with the camera. I'm trying to do it at the same time. Hi, guys. This this is uh, Julia's fiance, Don. And we wanted to say that Baddie's complete seasoning is really good. We've tasted other complete seasonings. I can't believe it. I can't read it. Uh, there's so much sugar in my eyes. Okay. In ingredients, vegetable dehy dehydration, I can't read it. Dehydrated vegetables, garlic and onion, salt, marsan, MSG. MSG. Uh, garlic. Spices, herbs, and, and tricalcium phosphate, as an anti caking agent. That's probably a preservative. I see it into the onions and herbs. Onion, garlic, spices, black pepper, sweet chili peppers, parsley, celery seed, basil, bay, mar marjoram, oregano, savory, thyme, cayenne pepper, cor coriander, cumin, mustard, ro rosemary, orange peel, natural flavors. Let me see what's in the. Did I use the. Oh, I know one I didn't use. That would taste good. Okay, 
Okay, so this one is Italian medley. I'm gonna put a little bit of that on there. And it's garlic spices. It's pretty much similar stuff as the onion and herb. Garlic spices, basil, oregano, rosemary, parsley, marjoram, white pepper, sage, savory, cayenne pepper, thyme, bay, what is that? cumin, what is that called? mustard, coriander, onion, real bell pepper, natural flavor, citric acid. So Mrs. Dash. Mrs. It's, Dash it's, seems like good stuff. Mrs. Da Dash Italian medley. Yeah, Italian we, medley. We, yeah, we should get more of Mrs. Dash. And I think this is also Mrs. Dash. No, this is. Pink, perfect pinch. I like this one. This is the steak flavor, perfect pinch, and I like to use it on other things besides steak. Well, let's see. Um, the chicken You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna make this, this is Italian marinated chicken cutlet, right? Do I have any more bread? Oh, I know I don't. Barely any. I'm thinking of making a sandwich. Well, I have french fries. Maybe I can make a meal with french fries. I'm not in the mood for chicken cutlet. Like I just went to an Italian restaurant two years ago. I mean, I'm not in the mood for chicken and parmesan. Maybe I can like um, get the cheese ready. I'm telling you, I'm not in the mood for chicken parmesan. I'm telling the show. Uh, The the yeah, I know. Bucket. McDonald's not the end of the world. I cleaned out the sauce pan for you. I cleaned it out. No, not the fine. The sauce pan cleaned it. Support. It was very difficult to clean all that cargo off of it. You needed to clean it either way. Yeah, no, I was going Okay, why? Right? I haven't doing the cooking show. All right, all right. Oh, there's still is bread. Yeah, I put that in there before. Alright, so I got a sandwich I'm gonna make. Okay, this is enough. I got some hero bread right here. Just gonna cut it down. You just gotta take, you can use a butter knife. You can use a butter knife. It's gonna wash off this butter knife. There should be a little, there should be a clean one inside the uh, cupboard, a cleaner butter knife. Can you get out a clean butter knife? Yeah, sure, of course, of course. I'll put my baby out, no problem. This one, this one is the cleanest. You want to have a cook, you want, you want to try having a cooking show and make money on it? You'd rather have to get a long movie on our filming. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I get so attracted to you, I don't want to do it. <laughs> okay, so look, you just, you just, you just get a butter knife, right? And all you gotta do is cut it down. Obviously put it on a flat surface. Let me just flip this over first. Flip this, I'm gonna flip the chicken over. You put it like this. I'm pretty sure you can see it. And you just flip it over. See how it's, it's, Probably yeah, done. It's probably done already. Yeah, it's good breading. Yeah, so like, it's really simple. If you just, if I just broke it down for you, it, re it really, I really made it simple for you. So, um, anyway. Yeah, you, you just gotta like. I'm gonna just, I know Let you can't, I, I know, I know they, they can't see it good right now, but I'm gonna cut it down. Yeah, you cut it because 
It got hard at first. Thank you. Cut it down the middle. Yeah, and show them how it opens. Yeah, it opens like this. That way you can put the meat inside. And then, you know, I'm probably going to put like mayonnaise or ranch dressing on the top. I can't say. Perfecto. Anyway, what's your favorite thing to have in a sandwich? What's your favorite thing to have in a sandwich? Uh, chicken cutlet, I prefer a little Parmesan cheese on it and maybe some ketchup or tomato sauce. I like... She likes ranch dressing. Yeah, I like having like chicken cutlet with like... No, what's my favorite sandwich? Like, like, hey, is this the last one of chicken cutlet? Um, no, there's one more piece in there. Is it, is it the small piece? You didn't want me to marinate that piece, so I didn't. So I can marinate it now. No, that's really good. Let's eat it. No, if you want it, you can have it. All right. Anyway, so my food is done. I got this clean plate. This is the result. I got to take it off there before it starts popping. Cause this is where I want to fix it up. Okay. Okay. Let me show you. Start friend and everything. I don't know if I even need to put anything on this. It's gonna taste good. Without making on it. Oh my god. I'm gonna put like I would taste the best on this. Mm. Maybe the blue cheese? Yeah, I was thinking that when I was making the bubbles, I'm sure. Okay, 
so oh you can see it good right now okay so i'm gonna just pour some blue cheese on it okay Okay, guys. Thank you, babe. You're welcome, darling. Oh. Are, we off, are we off TV, finally? Huh? I don't TV. I want to talk about it. I don't see my sandwich, but... I don't have a friend or anything anymore. No. Mmm, mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. So, it was nice cooking for you guys. The food is delicious. And I hope you agree with me how, de how delicious it looks and eats. And, um, yeah, just hit a like button. Subscribe, hit the notification bell. And comment what your dreams are in life. Okay, love you. Bye.